All right, good evening, guys. I know I usually open it up with good morning, but uh, it's actually evening right now. I wanted to start the video here in the evening. Um, it's right around, what, 5 o'clock, somewhere right around there. I wanted to show you guys, you know, what goes on here in the evening and what we do in the evening and how we shut up the store and how we close it up and, you know, just what goes on here. Um, no, we are not closing up the store as far as closing up and going out of business. Uh, I know it says uh, closing up, but no, we're not closing up the store. Check this out. This is directly, well, not directly, but within eyesight of where, we're, where our store is. This guy has had his motorbike here. The rear end's up. He's got it blocked up. And uh, that's been sitting there now for about, what? An hour now, maybe? Just spewing smoke out down the road. And then look. Occasionally he comes out. Throttles it up. Blows more smoke down the road. And then I'll go back into his apartment and uh, come out again in 15 minutes and do the same thing. So I showed you my area of responsibility yesterday, which is this area right in here, right by the hot water or the cold water and the hot water maker. You know, I leave this thing off. I don't leave it on during the day, the hot water maker. But what I do is usually in the evening we'll, we'll make a coffee and then I'll just switch it on and bring up the hot water. It only takes about five minutes to bring it up to hot water and make some hot water and uh, get some coffee. That's just the, one of the things we do. I know this is uh, kind of, I don't know, not very entertaining, I guess, but uh, <laughs> this is one of the things we do here. In the evening, grab a cup of coffee, but, oh, somebody mentioned about smoking. Who smokes? Uh, we have the ashtray because Lutz, one friend that comes here, the other girl that runs the Sorry Sorry store, there's Lut working, um, she smokes, so, we get out the ashtray so she can smoke. Um, I'm the vapor. I know smoking's bad for you, vaping's bad for you, but uh, I'm the vapor. Coffee is served. Guys, one of the things we want to get is a banner, like a sign. You can see this here, this TNT. JD's can't, uh, Carindiere, uh, Carindiere, however you pronounce that. They have these signs here, and we got to get one made, uh, hanging up right here at the uh, LNH, sorry, sorry, store. You can see they have one here. This one here is Landor put that one up. Like I said, I think he's something to do with his wife, or maybe he has a, has a dental clinic or something, but he has that one up. Okay. We want to get one that says LNH Sorry Sorry Store. It's actually one of the things we want to do tomorrow. Um, we got, we're not going to open up first thing in the morning because we still got to uh, do some shopping. We got to do some grocery shopping for at home. Um, got to get some food, actually get it over here, put it in the refrigerator since we're here most of the time. And uh, so we have something in the refrigerator to eat all day so we're not snacking and buying off of all the vendors around here. But yeah, that's one of the things we've got to do. Uh, let me see what else. Got to pick up a few things tomorrow also. Got to look for a little mat, a little bedding to put upstairs, uh, to have upstairs. So her brother has somewhere to sleep. Got the kids out running around playing <laughs> non-stop. Kids running, kids playing. But yeah, we gotta do that. Uh, what else we gotta do tomorrow? Get a fan, gotta get a fan for upstairs. But mostly we gotta do some shopping. Gotta sleep in too a little bit tomorrow. Well, we gotta get up at five to get Hannah Grace off the school, but maybe lay back down and uh, do some sleeping. But yeah. Oh, and anyways, tomorrow morning, well actually it's this morning in the States, uh, Philadelphia Eagles are in the Super Bowl, so 
I'll get to watch that because that's only the only football game they actually serve, show here in the Philippines is the uh, the Super Bowl. So I'll get to see that. Um, I am a Cowboys fan, but you know what? I am from Philly, and uh, I do hope the Eagles win. But yeah, that's what's going on tomorrow. Just got some running around. We'll probably be up here in the afternoon and open everything up, but tomorrow morning is going to be a relaxing morning. You guys, one of the things I do usually in the evening is I break out the stool and I sit down and I people watch. I definitely can do a lot of people watching here. I really enjoy a lot of times just sitting here, not during the day, of course, because it's too hot, but in the evening, everybody's riding by, walking by, and I'll just sit here and I'll people watch. I enjoy doing that. All right, guys, I gotta head up the road now. I uh, bought the grill tonight. I'm gonna grill out on the, uh, I'm gonna grill some lamb boat tonight. So I brought the grill along, but I need to get a potato. And uh, they're gonna have me some fried potatoes with some onions. And uh, I'm gonna be cooking up some liempo on the grill. So I gotta head up the road here and go to one of these little shops and get a potato. Well, here's a veggie store. Oh, potato. One, only one piece. Now I'll eat one potato. <laughs> Mikano, how much? Sixteen pesos. Sixteen pesos for one potato. All right, guys, this is my grill. In case you haven't seen it before, uh, I brought it from the States. Um, it's a charbroil. The name is charbroil. And I actually brought a couple bottles over. And what I do is, once the bottles go empty, I have a fitting that I'll throw on it. And I'll fill it up from the bigger LPG tank that I have at home. But what I do is, I, um, of course, you can see the, f the flame going right now. I'll light it and then I'll get the charcoal started and everything like that. Keeps it burning and everything. And uh, <clears throat> then I'll shut the gas off and then the coal just keeps uh, burning and everything. But yeah, everybody's walking by and they're smiling and laughing. Look at this Kano. <laughs> this Kano is crazy. It's not a Hawaii grill. But yeah, this is a grill. I mean, I brought it, like I said, by like buying it over when we first came over. And uh, it works great for us. There it is, got the Liempo on the grill. Like I said, what's nice about this too is if it starts going out, I can always turn the, the uh, flame on and finish it up that way. But uh, I actually replaced this here. It came with a, a different type of top with burned out and everything like that. So I picked up this grill real cheap at the market, but hey, it does the job and it gets the food cooked. One of the things with cooking Liempo, there's so much grease in it and uh, and the flames go a spark and then flying. So you've got to constantly move it around or she'll wind up crispying one side. <laughs> there it is, guys. Here's dinner tonight. Nothing fancy, just simple potatoes, some rice, liempo, and uh, eggplant. That's dinner tonight with a delicious cup of water. 
Here's the view from the upstairs balcony. You can see the streets are dead. Sunday evening, I don't know, seven o'clock. Like I said, everything seems to be dead on Sunday. Well, first Sunday I've been here this late, so. But we will stay open. So somebody asked about the cell phone and how that works. Um, what Lut does is she'll ask him for their telephone number and she'll put it into the phone and then she will ask how much load they want and then she'll put the load and then she'll send the load and uh, she'll also confirm um, the telephone number so they get the number right. And then she'll send the load and what happens then is the load gets sent to the the person receiving the load in the phone and they'll get a notification like right on the spot that they received it and um, so that way load knows they received it plus and the customer who is getting the load will also know that they received it so that's kind of how we do it um, some places will hand the phones to people and let them put their own numbers in. But if they punch in the wrong number, then, you know, that's on, well, it would be on us. Um, but it, And if Louisa punches in the wrong number also, that would also be on us. But at least we know when it's sent, they get a message right away that they received it. All right, look, what were you just telling me? Huh? What, were you just, what were you just telling me? I said this area was all globe. This area is all globe. Yeah. Only a handful of smart. See, we're, yeah. start, we're starting to learn what, you know, the, this community and, and what they like to get, what they like to buy. And, uh, but globe is the hot cell phone carrier in this area. Yeah. I mean, you still sold a couple smart. Yeah, I got like today, like, Almost all people buy me loads. Right. And I know today I went up to the mall and got a 500 peso load for Globe. So. Yeah, see, I have 374. Yeah. Her phone will give her the balance of how much is left. But yeah, I went up to the mall today and picked up a 500 peso load. So in about a week, she sold a thousand pesos worth of Globe load. So Globe is the hot thing in this area. All right, guys, it is, I don't know, almost nine o'clock, somewhere around there. And uh, we're gonna wrap this up. But yeah, I wanted to show you what goes on here in the evening. Um, Lud actually said today was a good day, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I wasn't here in the morning, so I don't know what all was sold, but she said this morning was very busy. Um, and then I went, I went to the mall. Yeah. Yeah, I went to the mall and everything like that. So I wasn't here, um, this, well, 
late morning, early afternoon, and she said that there was a lot being sold then, so today was a pretty decent day, she said. But anyways, word is getting around. <laughs> word is getting around, and uh, you know, we're, we're building, you know, a, a customer base here and everything like that, so. Anyways, guys, tomorrow we are gonna be closed. We might come over later on, but uh, I'll still be uh, doing some videoing, so. Anyways, guys, uh, anything to say, Lut? Please subscribe to his uh, YouTube channel. Anything to say, Hannah Grace? Voila. Voila. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. See ya.